Let's start at 20. Yeah, go ahead. Start at 20. Start at 20. Genesis chapter 25, verse, verse 20. And Isaac was 40 years old when he took Rebekah to wife, the daughter of Bethuel, the Right, which Isaac, he was the uh, uh, the, uh, the the youngest son of Abraham, right? Because what uh, you know about you know about the Ishmaelites, then the so-called Arabians over there, all right? You, yeah, you know the Ishmael. Uh, yeah, that that that's who their forefather is, Ishmael. Okay. But Ishmael, he wasn't uh, uh, given a blessing. He said, because the scripture said, from uh, 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 Isaac shall thy seed be called. All right. So who's the descendant of Isaac, Jacob, and where are his descendants? How do we identify that through the Bible, through the person, through Romans the twenty-eight chapter? Do Ezekiel 38 chapter. Different scriptures in the Bible. That, that's fine. That's how we identify ourselves as uh, uh, being an Israelite. Kind of Go ahead. Pinpoint more so on Israel. Yeah, that's right. He's all like, but but what, what, is, what are the descendants of Israel like? We're going are to they, it. He's coming. Why are they bad? No, no, read. Uh, He's getting a history lesson because history is uh, in, in the Bible. This, 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 this has all the ancient history. All right, why do you think they made the movie Book of Eli? And who wanted that book so bad? To who wanted to get it from the so-called black guy so bad? The so-called white guy. He wanted it so bad. He didn't want it to have it because why? Hey, even he didn't quite start up the book. You ever seen the book of Eli? Have you ever seen it? I didn't see that. Yeah, right. The guy, he wanted the Bible so bad because it's a spiritual book. It's not just a book. Of, exactly. He could use it to what? To manipulate the minds of the people. Which people he manipulated? What a slave. He could grab a slave he signed by the shot. And this is going into who we saw it is. We're just going to give you a crash course. Uh, yeah, yeah, right. Hey, that, hey this, this, this right here. This is the Edomites did to us, man. This is going into who they is. But keep reading that scripture. Uh, uh, it's a lot. Really, what, what are the like, people that are considered to be in the Bible? So, if I wanted to ask a question, I'm going to go back. Like, Bible dictionary. I'm going to do something wrong. All I'm tell you is. Verse 21, and Isaac entreated the Lord for his wife. Yeah, because his wife, she, she, she couldn't get pregnant. Go ahead. Because hey, she was this. barren, and the Lord was entreated of him. Yeah, right. And Rebecca was wife. Rebecca, his wife, conceived. Yeah. Verse 22, and the children struggled together with their mm -hmm. And she said, if it be so, why am I thus? Yeah, so she was complaining. If it was a blessing to, to, to get pregnant for the first time, why is, why is her baby struggling in the womb? Struggling mean, why are they fighting? Why is they bumping heads, if you will? Yeah, right. Why ain't they attracted to each other, right? Jacob and Esau was there already. Go ahead. There's no going to it. And she went to inquire of the Lord, and the Lord said unto her, Two nations are in thy womb. Two nations, right? Go ahead. And two. Not just two people. Go ahead. And two manner of people. Two manner of people meaning these people gonna have one different set of characteristics and another people gonna have a different set of characteristics. Oh, right. What a what a sign that with we ain't African. So like, I got a quick uh, if I made my So two that. nations were not wound. Two manner of people. Meaning yeah. two they right exactly. Alright? This is the one manner of people right here. If you go hold that for me, huh? Right. The people on this side who they identify us. And, and that's what they call them. They identify us. They put those names on us, man. All right? Who identifies African-American. Uh, you got Muhammad Ali, for example. All right? You got Michael Jackson, for Michael Jordan, for example. All right? Uh, uh, James Brown. That's just the name of few. And then they try to say that what? That we African. All right? We, we, yeah, just because we got the same complexion. At one point in time, everybody on the planet Earth was, uh, I had melanated skin. All right? But we going to go into that because that's Esau, too. Go ahead. Get the word, all right? It says, uh, two men or people shall be separated from thy bow. Right. And the other people shall be stronger than the other people. Yeah, right, read that over. That's verse. Yeah, that right. Verse 23, started. and the Lord said unto her, two nations are in thy womb, and two men or people shall be separated from thy bow. Right, and we just identified as so-called white people and, and so-called black people because that's the name that they put on that bag. All right, really, they are Edomites, all right? The descendants of Esau are Edomites, so-called white people. Because Edom, uh, Esau and the uh, Edom is what? I, I Joshua, which means wasted away as he, which meaning he had no pigmentation. So-called white people, they, they, uh, 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 their skin is translucent. See, that's the thing about it. You got different two shades of people in the world. You got brown people and you got red people. 
It ain't no such thing as white people. These pe the, uh, the government and all the Illuminati, whoever, whatever, yeah, that's true. They put that name upon themselves because what? They know the definition of what the word means. They know the difference between the... See, we know, we, we understand words and things too. See, they think we just was going to be stupid and, and, and in a trance forever. But now we're waking up to who, are, who we really are. Keep going in there. All right, it says... Um, and the one people shall be stronger than the other. Right. Would you would you agree that so-called blacks are stronger than so-called whites? Would you agree with that? Genetically. Um, you do. You hit the biology. Yeah, yeah. You hit the hey, biology. Hey, because they showed they said that in the movie uh, Get Out. Yeah. You do. I know you seen that movie Get Out. When he told him you would be a specimen if you yeah, trained and yeah, all that. That's right. Because I, that's why he wanted his body. Yeah. That's why they wanted to transfer subconscious and all that wickedness, man. Right. I, so they can have the uh, the abilities. He was definitely yeah. just mad at Jake because what? He was like, because his grandfather beat him or that's something right, like I, that. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, he gave me a look, look, man. He gave me a one on one lesson. He's cool. He, he, he wanna listen. He might be a Jake, man. But let me just say, I, hey, yeah. he's, so yeah. you deal with biology, yeah. right? Yeah. Which genes That's are right. dominant? Yeah. If, if, uh, oh, if, black, again, if a black, if a black, if a black, let's say a black parent has a black mother or father has sex with uh, the opposite race, what genes gonna come out? Stronger genes, the dominant gene. Exactly. That's why the scripture taught us what? We ain't supposed to mix our holy seed. Because our seed that we plant and women aren't going back to our, our what? Our sperm that we put inside women is whole. All right? It ain't for all these other women. It's only for our women. All right? The nation of Israel. Can I, can I start that line back up? Yeah. Because you was talking about, uh, you said one, one people shall be stronger than the other. Now, in general, Who's the most athletic? And it's right here in your face. Who dominate all the sports, man? You were saying both. Who's right. the fastest on the earth? The world's fastest man. Who the best ball player that just left Cleveland and they just yeah. tore the poster down? Matt Singer. Who the best boxer, Muhammad Ali? Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Yeah, Come on, man. Come on, man. And this ain't about color. Now, let's go back to it. Color. Yeah, because we do got some, yeah. hey, we do got yeah, some people that look wet. No, if I can't speak, dude, I don't want to be here. Well, yeah, I agree with you. Like, what does that have to do with anything? If you want to speak, go on the corner right there and teach people. That's all we do. I don't want we don't mean you no know harm, bro. We don't mean you no harm, which is yeah, yeah. right. Let's go, bro. If, if I can't speak my mind, that's not fair. He get. We, he we're asked a question. We asked him this question. We're all brothers and sisters. But not a boy. Hey, get, uh, go to uh, second address, man. Six and, uh, Since he wanted to be. No, you don't right. have to tell me that. Yeah, right. Yeah. All right, man. You guys don't want to talk, man. I don't want to listen. Yeah, you and your second boy, man. Niggas, that's a problem. It's a lot to your eyes, man. That's the thing. Ecclesiastes 5 and 1 say, keep that foot when thou goest to the house of the most high, man. You got to be more ready to hear than to give the sacrifice of fools. Yeah, be more ready to hear than to give the sacrifice of fools. Yeah, be more ready than to give the sacrifice of fools. Be more ready to hear than to give the sacrifice of Think you that is a bad Who's Africa? Who is that? Uh, you, what, 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 what happened to Africa? You don't know the history of it. You well, took no, biology, I, man. I, don't think I know anything history. Anything. I don't think you took anything. biology. Africa, that ain't even the original name of that land over there. Yeah. That came from a so-called white man named what? Uh, Africano, uh, Leo yeah. Scipio Africano. Uh, and he led a siege over there and took those people down and then named the country after. That's why the scripture said that in without is, their houses shall continue forever, man. That's what they say. They, they, they named us that and after they know names. All right, call the law. You're like, y'all got shot by a shot by a shot. Yeah, man. And I hate dealing with niggas like that, man. But that shit, we gotta suck on this side, man. Honestly, that's that shit fucking suck, bro. But that shit, we gotta suck on this side because niggas don't wanna get right, man. Okay, God, man. Because niggas don't wanna get right. I, I got something for a lot of them. Um, get that, get that, uh. Man, fuck you. Um, give me the book of Jeremiah. All right, Sean. Jeremiah, the fifth chapter, let me see what verse let me read it right there. Jeremiah 5. Jeremiah 5 started about, started about 25. 25, you don't read it to the end. Alright, this Jeremiah chapter 5, verse 25. It says, your iniquities have turned away these things. And your sins have withholding good things from you. Now, the point is, point is this. He could have been an Israelite. That's why the brother was trying to spirit. And he found out not to be a he believer. Made, he listened. You know? he, he, but, but he didn't. No, he, he, he said he didn't believe in the Bible. That's right. But he's still here the whole time to get that information. That's right. And listen to the scriptures being brought up. That's right. So whether he be an Israelite or not, because, you know, that's why we're trying to the spirit. 
But then unless you're going to be revealed, you know, in due season. That's right. Go ahead, though. I'll just keep going on that. He said, your iniquities have withhold these things. So your sins have withhold the good things from you. He said, it's the kingdom of us ruling in righteousness. Hey, man, these guys trust in oppression, as the scripture says, man. They like it. They nine to five. You know? That's something that I can Lord willing, I'm going to keep hitting on, too, man. Because I don't like that shit, man. I'm going to keep fucking waking up. Early as fuck to serve the oppressor. Huh. The most vile person upon all the earth, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we ran into the into the into the into the mountains, man. Go ahead, brother. Verse 26, for among my people are found wicked men. Uh-huh. And and whether it be two-thirds of the nation of Israel or these other heathen nations, like the brother brought up earlier, we sit there as a seed. Alright? Alright, you got the house of Saul, like the brother said, the house of David. Okay? So he said, among my people, amongst us, in our in our general area, are found wicked men. Okay, and, and what did the scripture say even about Israel and the Maccabees, man? They went out wicked men of Israel to pretty much try to uh, have us, uh, they would have made a covenant with the heathen. Right. Okay? Yeah, because if I could say this, they're subject to sin. Yeah. That's what they is. They under subjection to their flesh. They can't get no control of their flesh. They just love feeding their flesh. That's what it is. They ain't spiritual. That's right. That's ultimately why two thirds gonna die. They ain't spiritual. That's right. They corner. Oh. That's the spirit, because while I was looking for that precept in the book of Hebrews, I found the one that said, uh, uh, it is impossible, to, without faith, it is impossible to please the Lord, man. You know? Straight up. Without faith, you can't please Heavenly Father. You know, and these guys are carnal men, so of course they can't please Heavenly Father. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, brother. Verse 26, for among my people are found wicked men. Yep. They lay wait as he that set it a snare. They have a trap. They catch men. Yeah, they set a trap. They catch men, man. All right, that's what the guy was trying to do. We're the teachers, okay? Humble down and take heed, okay? Yeah, that's he what a pupil does, yeah, that's man. That's what I heard. The dude was asking all the questions. Yeah. He was being deceptive. Well, I'm from California. We're all, you know, you're an eater, man. Yeah. And, and that they, guy, you know? Yeah. And just laying back off the brother's spirit, just, you know, just saying the same thing, man. Essentially, man, they, they say they're trying to set a trap. He want to be the one to try to tell us. You know, to try to teach us what to say, how to how to interpret the Bible. You know, but no, we've been out here first. You came on our platform, man. You're building upon another man's foundation. Excuse me, say let every man take heed how he built up there upon, man. You enter into other men's labors, man. You can't go switching the doctrine. Go ahead. Go. Verse 27: As a cage is full of birds, yep. so also their house is full of deceit. Uh huh. Therefore, they are become great and wax and rich. Right, and how do you catch a bird? You got to set a trap, man. You got to lay the bait there, and when they get up in there, then it fall behind them. That trap's off, okay? And, and the fowler, the fowler is what they call them, man. All right, and that's initially what they try to do in the same instance, man. Try to catch men, try to set up us. I mean, try to set us up, try to subvert whole houses, you know? Hey, hey uh, keep on deck, too. I mean, you can finish reading this, but, like, the brother had you going into that Titus, bring up the same precepts he had you going into. But finish that up too when you get the chance. Or worse than shit. Yeah, they straight up full of shit, man. They smell like shit. But the crazy part about it is they worse than shit because shit is a fertilizer. Yeah. That, that's, that stank shit over there that we you know was standing next to yesterday. Uh, and he's just doing a purpose. Esau has no purpose. He wasted away. Right. They full of shit, but they worse than it. The same needle mites, man. He needs to ask some basic questions, man. But he did tell me. They full of deceit, like I said, and, and, and the devil, the, the Diablos, okay, in the Latin is, dece is a deceiver, man. He gonna deceive you into taking that chip. Hey, out of all the things the brothers were just telling him, he probably still gonna take that damn chip. Completely forgot, he gonna go on one end out the other. Hey, if, if, he, if he's a heathen, it don't even matter. It don't matter. That, that's one thing you heathen better get in your mind right now. You got the heathens that are gonna rebel against this system. Well, I'm not Which taking that chip. Yeah. It don't That's matter, man. Right. If you if you're a heathen, man, you gonna, your ass gonna get uh your ass gonna get chipped and you gonna down. get destroyed. Or you can just decide not to get chipped and get destroyed on there. But it don't matter. The only ones that that, that can refuse the chip is the uh the Jakes, the Israelites, man. That, that's the only one who the Lord actually have a problem with taking. You don't have a problem with you. So you don't have a problem with your bond to your God. Yeah. You have a problem with Israel. That's right. I but the problem is, among our people are foul, wicked men. And Israel don't know that they Israel, so they're going with every way for doctrine. Hey, I couldn't, I could, that scripture in there, you couldn't, you couldn't have, you couldn't have said that better, man. Among my people are foul, wicked men, man. Straight up. You, you, you read, you, when you read during the Maccabees and, the, and during the time of, uh, I think it was Nehemiah, when Nehemiah was trying to rebuild the wall, you had Israelite that was trying to, uh, break, trying to sell them out and, 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 and help, uh, the two heathens, man. So our, our people, man, you could, what it is, it, it compromises your position in whatever kingdom you was in. Right. Let's say you was in the Roman Empire and, and uh, the emperor was handing your ass gold and you had a nice little house over there on the shore or whatever. 
So it's like now, if you had to go fight with us, it's like you compromise your position in that kingdom. You're like, oh, hell no, I ain't giving up, I'm giving up, right? That's like you'll be on the movie Roots, uh, Fiddler, or like on Django. You had yeah, guys that didn't want to give up that position of being a house nigga. Yeah, hell yeah. These, these guys comfortable working what? They might be a bank seller. They might yeah. make like $30 an hour. Yeah. If you're in the union, you're making like $30 an hour to full scale, you right. know? Some shit like that. They don't want to give up that position because they're like, man, I got to go. Man, yeah. Why y'all got to go? I'm yeah. compromised. Man, you got to be willing to forsake all things, man. Hey, what, what Moses do, Fuck man? Fuck that shit, man. Yeah, Moses